the journey to running for office uh, really began in, at the presidential election of 2016. And I didn't know it then because it was never kind of in my cards to be a politician um, and to run for office. And so, um, but in 2016, you know, I was pregnant with my fourth child. And after that uh, election, it was just really kind of stunning. Um, and it was really discouraging for Nat and myself. And just kind of thinking through that night even, um, you know, uh, Fritz has talked a little bit about kind of my history coming here. And so, um, you know, when I think about kind of my life's journey and what that moment meant on election night, uh, you know, my parents at the end of the Vietnam War, my dad was sent to a re-education prison and he was there for a couple of years. And when he was released, my parents were like, we don't have a future under this oppressive regime and we really need to leave. And so, like many people before and after them, they made that decision to risk everything they had, right, for hope, opportunity, and freedom. And, uh, and we see that now, and I know we'll talk about it a little bit later, about kind of the immigrant and refugee situation that we're facing, not just in this country, but I think worldwide. And um, so I know, you know, I knew what my parents had risked to get us to America. I knew what, all the hard work that they had put into their life's work. Um, and so to see the results of, of election night in 2016 was extremely discouraging. And to know that not just kind of my family had, had gone through those uh, trials, you know, Matt also has family that, um, that left kind of a very anti-Semitic Europe um, and had started over in America. And so, you know, here we are expecting this brand new life and, you know, kind of juxtaposing both of that. And we decided that uh, for us, what was really important was that this baby was going to have a name that reflected our values kind of in this moment. Like, kind of for us, it was really important. We actually said to ourselves, I think this is going to be a resistance name. Mm -hmm. um, but we decided to name the baby Elise Minkun. And Elise was inspired by Ellis Island. So Matt has family that passed through Ellis Island as they were escaping anti-Semitism and began their lives in America. Minh Khan is Vietnamese for Bright Bell, and that was inspired by the Liberty Bell. And to us, her name means to ring the bells of liberty and champion opportunity for all. And so we had her, you know, I was due with her on inauguration day. She came a couple of days later, thank goodness. Um, and then she was a month old when I decided to run because I realized I couldn't spend all my time sitting on the couch you know, crying over what was happening. And, mm -hmm. and if you recall back in the first, you know, month, six weeks of the Trump administration, a lot happened, right? Mm -hmm. And so, um, you know, we made the decision to run. It was really important to, to, to both of us that all of our kids knew that we were gonna do everything we can, right? As our country is facing these moments of crisis, which has totally borne out that we were gonna do everything we can for them. And so I decided to run and took the whole family with me. I mean, they were all like parts of our campaign, um, and so it's been great.